Hi friends, this is Gani. Today I am going to explain you how to create this type of model and member placement and beam placement and uh, roof panel placement and opening for the panel opening. Before going to create this type of model, for more Tekla related videos, go to my channel youtube.com slash Gani SK. I will provide this link in the description below of this video. Go through it. Here you can find out so many Tekla related videos. I am going to upload every day a new video, Tekla related videos. Please come here and watch. Please click on subscribe. If you subscribe, you will get notification when I upload new videos. Okay, let's start. I am going to delete this uh, model and I am going to create a fresh model once again. Uh, blank uh, project. I am going to create the columns at this moment. Go to the steel and select the column and place the column here. I am going to change this uh, height of bottom 0 and top 20 feet as it is not by close. Okay. I am going to place the columns uh, at this location and here and here like this here. these are the columns and I am going to place the beams from here and then here just like that here from here okay. uh, and in the in this direction I'm going to place beams in this direction from here take when I um, creating beam click at the endpoints of the columns placed columns and beams but our condition is uh, this building slope in the slope uh, top roof uh, must be in the slope then uh, go to the edit and go to the construction and take the plane and take the plane at here just like take the points for the plane creation yeah this is the plane double click on it and in magnetic option click on S and modify it ok set the plane once again and I am going to uh, change this height of the building one side higher and the other side is lower then select this plane and hold alt button hold alt button and select this uh, point and right click on mouse more special linear in z direction i am going to enter value here 10 feet more okay now you can see you can create easily this single stroke building like this and after modifying you can delete this select it the plan and delete it no more required that plan now this is a single slope building ok uh, now how to create this panel on this roof uh, go to the application and components by using the shortcut control F here initially you will see like this uh, you may see like this uh, enter the name here floor floor ok now click on show hide here you can see this is floor click on this floor layout close it and select the points where you want to create a floor yeah that's fine for the first time it might be seems seems to be like this and we are uh, select this select component option and then double click on it we are going to change this profile roof panel profile 
I'll come here. This is Paycast, and uh, you have to uh, select the standard profile sheet profile, proof, proof sheet profile, browse from here and go to the decking and slab profile and go to the wall craft decking and roof profile here these are the standard profiles you can choose from here otherwise you can create custom profile also i will explain how to create custom uh, roof sheet profile in the next video i'm going to take this one and six and three and sixteen now uh, ga gauge profile okay click on it and name i'm going to change this roof panel roof panel and class color i'm going to change to 2 class 2 and material grade this is not concrete uh, this is the steel material sheeting must be steel material and grade uh, a36 i'm going to Select this A36 grade and OK. Click on it. You can change. You can save this uh, values from here. Give the name. Roof panel like that and click on save as. When you click on save as, you can see here in this list uh, this file name appear. You can load it and use any number of times when you save this file okay click on modify here you can see this is the roof panel yeah here you can see this is roof panel. click on space and later view yeah this is the panel roof panel shift to control to shift 4 but this panel in the beam so we, we have to change this depth of the panel I'm going to along grid D okay uh, use control I shortcut for view list here if you don't have if you don't know how to create this views I'll create once again for you For the first time you will see like this blank views and then click on grid right click on mouse and create views along grid lines create click on grid. then you will see this kind of list i'm going to see elevation on grid b so elevation on grid b click on it here you can see panel is inside of the beam but uh, by practical it's not possible so select this panel and use control m shortcut for move this panel select this panel and control m right click on mouse and move so from here to top of the beam select the top of the beam okay now you can see it's exactly on the top of the beam yeah this right use the control tab for next 3d view here you can see the name 3d this is 3d view use the shift shift 4 control 4 for solid view yeah this panel placement this is the panel placement uh, here you can see uh, when you select this option select object and component these are the different panels you can control the panel width, change the panel width according to your standard or your requirement. For example, 2 feet 2 inches your panel width, then we will change those things. We will see it. Double click on it. Uh, in general, uh, in general, you can see this is the default panel part width. You can change this panel width. For example, you required. 2 feet 2 inch panel width then enter here 2 feet 2 inch modify 2 feet 2 feet 2 inch yeah 2 feet 2 inch modified yeah 
Now this panel width is 2 feet 2 inch. Shell top chicken complete or width. Shell top chicken component and here this it panel width must be 2 feet 2 inch. Now use direct modification. Activate this icon and click uh, select object, select component and click on it and go to here and select this option. Here you can see now this width is 2 feet 2 inch here. Okay. Okay. Now I am going to deactivate this icon. Select object and component. Now uh, here you can see these are different panels uh, there is no lap uh, between two panels there is no lap between two panels if you want to create lap between the two panels then select uh, component option and double click on it go to the general if you want to create the uh, two inch lap between two panels then come here and here gap width here give the minus 2 inch modify yeah it's fine you can see the result now select component object and component and now the panel lap must be 2 inch you can control like that how much lap you required you can enter the value there you can change the lap ok that's the option there and for example if you want to change the direction of this panel yes you can do it select this panel and then come here you can see here little icon over there select it come here select this option here you can see the arrow direction this is the arrow direction select this point and drag from over there to and zoom it hold the here here you can see panel direction has changed you can also adjust this the panel direction also but by default it should be in this direction only so I am going to change this panel direction once again yeah select it and then come here and select this option then you can see this arrow direction select this arrow direction and drag from here to select it and come here and select this direction and from here to in this direction I am going to change from here zoom it and select this arrow yeah this is the right direction you can change the direction of the panel from one direction to another direction now I am going to create opening uh, for sometimes you require the opening on this roof panel then uh, come here select it and over here this is the opening select it where you require then select and drag it for example if you need 4, four feet by 4 feet opening then come here and select here you can create it like that uh, click on space and drop select read view you can see the opening at this location If you want to change this opening, uh, now the opening size is 4 feet by 4 feet. If you want to change the 4 feet, 4 by 4 feet by 4 feet to 5 feet by 5 feet, then select here and here select this value and enter the 5 feet and click on enter on your keyboard. Now it must be 5 feet. Similarly, like that, you can also change here 5 feet enter. Now the opening must be 5 feet. If you want to change only one direction, for example, uh, this is 5 feet by 5 feet. If you want to change 5 feet to 6 feet, uh, only in this direction, 
then select the value and give the arrow at this location select this option and change 6 feet and enter when when you click on enter the opening direction must be changed in this direction only yeah like this you can also change here also if you want to change uh, up, upside direction then click on it and change 6 feet enter here we go you can see this opening changes occur in this direction you can change like that yeah this is the panel roof panel placement and opening roof opening opening and how to place this kind of model okay if you have any doubts please comment below please go to my channel and please click on subscribe you will get notification when i upload new videos thank you